It is no secret that Hollywood is a terrible place. Today we have this absolutely insane story about an actress who admits all of that, who admits that it is a horrible place, especially for young women. And some of the stuff that Jodie Foster says here about Hollywood is absolutely wild. So we're going to get into this whole crazy story here and see what is going on. Jodie Foster issues warning to young stars torturing themselves, saying celebrity culture is already toxic. Two-time Academy Award winning actress Jodie Foster said she feels protective over young celebrities navigating Hollywood today. Now, why would that be? Why would she especially feel protective over young celebrities? Well, I think we all know the answer to that. It doesn't take much of a genius to know anything about the history and the background of Hollywood to know that there's a lot of people out there who prey on younger people. The 61-year-old star expanded on her thoughts during a recently published interview with Elle magazine for its 2023 Women in Hollywood issue. I find myself reaching out to girls who could be my daughters and saying, wait a minute, you keep doing dumb things on publicity tours. What's going on with you? This is a little self-sabotage. You know better than that. Who's letting you do that? And where's your mom? <laughs> I don't know if Jodie Foster is just like old fashioned or what, but I love it. Like that, that final question right there is exactly <laughs> what more and more people need to be asking these days. Where is your mom? Where is your dad? Where are these people? Our fatherless society that we are continuing to nurture and feed into is just getting beyond insane at this point. And I think we can all see that in our society. Uh, you know, you have things like OF and all these different platforms and, and just uh, all the disgusting stuff. Like I could go on and on probably for a, a, a complete hour talking about all of the disgusting, degenerate things that our society continues to engage in. But she continues on and says, I do have this really big soft spot for the young actresses who came up as young people because I just don't I just don't know how they survive without some mother around the way I had a mom around. And this right here is alarming because unfortunately there are a lot of young people who are just kind of shoved off into Hollywood and by their parents and they're just like, yeah, go go make us money. We see this happen all the time with young celebrities in Hollywood, especially people that work for Disney, especially. And you think for a family-friendly company that they would have some sort of positive experience and outcome because of that, but the complete opposite it continues to happen all the time. Foster said part of the problem with young stars today is their tendency to share too much of themselves with the public. To be able to say you're overexposed or you're torturing yourself or you have to have faith in your talent, you can go away for two years and have a life and come back and there will be work for you. Yeah, maybe it won't be in some franchise, but what do you care? This is your life. And I wouldn't be surprised, and maybe this is just me just thinking very cynically about all of this, I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of it is their parents who are keeping them there because their parents are just thinking about the money. You know what I mean? Like their parents are just so focused on the fact that they can continue to benefit from the success of their child. Ultimately, Foster is glad she's now older and wiser. And she went on to say this alarming thing, but I know how to take care of myself. And maybe that's a product of my baggage in this terrible world that I came out of, like my own survival mechanism. But I know what it takes to survive. And I really feel bad for young people. The way she's talking, you'd think that she'd be talking about like a Mad Max you know, environment that she grew up in or some sort of like crazy asylum or something like that. But no, she's talking about Hollywood. She's talking about a place where all of our biggest entertainers continue to thrive and live. So anyway, let me know what you think about what she says here about Hollywood, especially because this just continues to show. And even though she didn't specifically say anything about Hollywood when it comes to things like peds and preds, I think that we can all see that she is talking about some absolutely horrific stuff that continues to happen in Hollywood, and we all are aware of it at this point, but we need more and more people to continue to speak out about this. With that being said, let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.